You're watching Bite Me TV. This week's episodes are sponsored by Purely Gadgets and Premier Computer Solutions. <laughs> Hello, I'm Keely and welcome to Buy Me TV. Now you may recall a couple of months ago I bought a laptop. Then I went out and treated myself to a printer. But now I'm getting really fed up of having to hook my laptop up with the printer. And I'm sure there's a way you can print wirelessly. So I'm gonna go and meet with Gary and see what he can do. So we need to look up about how to get um, videos onto my iPod and phone. Have you done it yet? No, I thought there'd be information on the web that I could look up. Well, we're putting it on our website, but in the meantime, let's just have a look here and let's see if we find anything interesting. Okay, well, there's this website. That okay. tells you a bit about it. I mean, I can tell you a lot more, but is that any use to you? That could be useful. Yeah? Okay, yeah. what about, I'll tell you what, let me print it out. We can have a look at that in a minute, okay? Okay. Right. There we go. Hang on to that. Thank you. There we go. Is that what you want? How did you just print that out? Press print. But the laptop's not hooked up to anything. Oh, it's wireless. Have you oh, done that before? I do think there could be a wireless option out there. Oh yeah, no, it's really cool actually means you don't have to get up from the sofa and go and pick it up, uh, connect it up and stuff like that. You just print, go and pick it up later. How? What, does, okay. what do you need? Well, I've got this thing called a print server. Plugs into okay. the wall. I plug the printer into it. I've got a bit of software to configure it all. And I just print directly from it. So that's as simple as that for that kind. And there's a few different ones on the market. I happen to have one here. This is the one made by Apple. But there's others who make and it. And what's it called? Belkin. That's called an Apple Airport Express. But there's a, there are others out there. There are other print servers made by Netgear, Belkin, other people. And basically all the same principle. Plug in, plug the printer in, a bit of software to configure it onto the network. Install your printer as you normally do. And bang, away you go. You can then just print directly from here without being connected. Well, you are connected, but you're connected wirelessly. OK, okay. so with this, you basically... The USB lead, which I now use to plug into my Plugs computer into there, to print, yeah. I'll plug my printer into this, and yeah. then how would this pick up with the computer? Would you need a software disk or something is, like that? There's a disk that comes with it, or you can download it off the website. You're basically, all you've got to do is plug the printer in and just do the normal setup for the printer. Is there not a printer that comes with this built in? Our wireless printers, there are quite a few of them out there as well, so you don't even need that. Just plug it into the wall, do a normal setup, just as if you've got a printer and it's already connected to your network. What is the cheapest way to do it? To buy a wireless computer or buy one of these? If you've already got another printer such as a desktop already connected to the printer and that's on the network, then you can just set up your network so that you connect to that computer and print through that. The only problem with that is that it's got to be connected and it's got to be switched on. But that's if you've already got that, that's the cheapest way to set it up. Can you connect uh, more than just one computer to a wireless printer? Oh, yeah, yeah. We've got a few. There's uh, three in here. All of them connect oh, really? to that, and any one of us can just print. Can you get a wireless printer with one of these built in? Yeah, yeah there's a few. Um, there are. If you're looking to get a new printer, you may as well consider getting a printer with the wireless already in there. Yeah. You can still connect them you know, with a wire if you want, but you've got wireless printing. They're built in. I think I saw there were about 30 of them out there when I was shopping for them recently. So there's quite a few to choose from. And these things, these print servers actually now are starting to have other features in it. Like you can connect external hard drives to them, play music through them as well. So they're doing more than one job, really. Have you got the disc that goes with this? No, I have misplaced it. But that's the beauty of the internet, because we could go and download it and then set it up. Well. I'm going to borrow this and take this home and see what I think um, and download it from the internet. Wait, wait, wait. You're taking that home? Yes. Then how am I going to print? I don't mm. know. I think we should go online and actually go and buy you one so that okay. if you are borrowing that, you won't be taking it for too long. Um, the only problem is I don't have a credit card, so um, would you like to buy me one? Oh, this is coming down to the, the lunch and everything else. 
that I end up paying for, and then you're going to get that as well. I don't have my car. Anything you like? <laughs> your new MacBook Pro, perhaps, whilst we're about it? Oh, that's a good idea. <laughs> So I've learned how to print wirelessly, and what Gary doesn't know is I've borrowed his Airport Express. I'm going to go home now and try it out. As always, for more information, visit our website, bitemetv.com. And next week, we'll be looking at video on the go, so stay tuned till then. And thank you for watching. See you next week on Bite Me. Bye-bye. <laughs>